It's all about the latest, or one of the latest, from the House of Parfums de Marley. It's Green Lee, this one right here. It used to be a different name, but now it's called Green Lee. And I'm not going to get into the technicalities of what happened, but this is a fragrance that I'm reviewing today for you as a Sathrabon review video. We do have a full bottle giveaway for subscribers of this channel from the USA. So if you're curious to learn about Green Lee from the House of Parfums de Marley, then please stay tuned. Thanks so much for tuning in. This is Sebastian with Smelling Great Fragrance Reviews. We're talking about Greenlee, as I said. Greenlee is an appropriate name for this one. I find it very green and fresh and fruity. Refreshing as well. And I'm gonna tell you all about this one. And uh, you know, I'm enjoying it. Uh, it's not like your typical uh, fragrances that I discovered uh, Parfums de Marley with. Uh, the more intense varieties, the the really intense woody, ambery, sweet, vanilla kind of fragrances. This goes uh, just much more fresh, similar in line with the, the last several fragrances. But I'll tell you all about this one and the giveaway. But before I get to the, the review, if this is your first time tuning into the channel and you still haven't subscribed, please do click the subscribe button below and also click the bell so you'll be notified for future videos and giveaways. So I was anticipating this release. It took some time to, uh, for me to receive the bottle. I did get this uh, and I requested it so this was sent to me for this specific review but I'm going to tell you my honest opinion and I'm sure you've heard uh, reviews on this one uh, as I see that there's a ton of them online already but thanks for tuning in to watch this one and to hear my opinion about this fragrance uh, for me and of course to have a chance at winning a full bottle if you are a subscriber from the USA. So Greenlee was launched in 2020. 125 ml bottle is $299. It's Eau de Parfum concentration and I would call this a fruity citrus aromatic. So for notes here what we've got are Sicilian bergamot, mandarin orange, green apple and cashmere wood at the top notes. Heart notes are cedar wood, Pettigran, Violet, and Pomerose. Base notes are Oak Moss, Musk, Amberwood Accord. And you're probably wondering what Pomerose is. Well, Pomerose is a high impact captive odorant patented by Givaudan. Pomerose has a powerful fruity rose odor with nuances of apples, plums, and raisins. And it makes total sense that they have uh, featured Pomerose as a note in Greenlee because this is about green apples for me. A very, very crisp but juicy, drippy, wet green apple note, which is a standout note for me in this fragrance. So the fragrance sprays on with this apple note at the top. It is a green apple. You can kind of tell it's got a kind of a tart, juicy, uh, consistent consistency, like a maybe like a Granny Smith apple. Um, that's what I'm kind of uh, picturing with this particular fragrance. And it is a kind of drippy kind, but also tart. It's sweet and tart at the same time, and you experience that at the top notes. It does get woody at the top notes as well uh, because of this cashmere wood note. And if you don't know much about cashmere wood, you should definitely search on my channel. I have videos that explain this particular uh, synthetic note. Um, it's a woody, ambery, musky uh, composition uh, that uh, is used a lot in perfumery. This is the first time I'm seeing it as a top note though. So in the top notes you do get the uh, the play of the two notes that are stand out for me but of course there's bergamot here. It is pretty prominent as well. Not as much as the apple and the cashmere wood but it's a nice addition of the citric uh, tart uh, juicy um, sweet and tart kind of combination of bergamot. Works great in the top. This is the first experience of this fragrance and I like what I'm smelling at the top notes. The heart is all about the combination of cedar wood with pettigran, but of course you are experiencing the violet and the pomerose as well. And the pomerose of course enhances the fruitiness of the apple that's already in the top. And it's a nice segue into the heart notes with all these notes combined together. Now the fragrance dries to a very, very mossy, woody, musky, um, composition. It does get ambery, but it's that amber wood accord at the base, obviously, and then the musk is pretty prominent here as well. And the, the moss, I mean, I th feel like it's a nice fusion of the three notes and the base notes, but for me, I get more moss. It's a green a greenness along with the, the musk. Those two are pretty stand out for me, but uh, you do experience a little bit of the amber wood accord as well. So what do I think about Greenlee then? You know, I am enjoying Greenlee a lot. I love this note in here and I love the combination of the crisp, juicy green apple note with the, the, the cashmere wood. And it's a great uh, 
experience. It's a great wearing experience. Is it something that I love? I'm enjoying it, but I prefer the fragrances from this house such as Herod, Leighton, Leighton Exclusive, Carlisle. Those are my favorite fragrances from this house. Is this something that's been done before? Yes, I've smelled fragrances like this before. This is uh, Parfums de Marley's version. And I like the whole green apple thing. It's a great twist and you know having this note in a, a collection of fragrances is uh, definitely a breath of fresh fresh air because I like the note itself I'm a big fan of apples to begin with and I love that whole combination of the juicy crisp apple with uh, the other notes in here so I am enjoying it but it's been done before this is the fragrance I've smelled before I like the change of pace that Parfums of Marley has given to me uh, with the Greenly. So if you haven't tested out a Greenly, I hope you guys get a chance to go smell it in stores or you know buy yourselves bottles uh, from stores or you know samples to test it out. But as I said, we do have a full bottle giveaway if you are a subscriber from the USA. Uh, it's a link to Safflebon Bon in the info box. Click that, head over there, and find out how to participate for your chance to win a full bottle of Greenly. Then please come back here and. Let let me know what you think about Greenly. Have you tried it yet? Uh, do you like it? Do you like the whole green apple thing? And also let me know if you're a fan of this house, Parfums of Marley, and what your favorite fragrances are. I'd like to find out. Other than that, guys, thanks so much for watching uh, my review for Parfums of Marley's Greenly. If you have any questions or comments, please list below. Otherwise, please like this video. Please share it. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and I'll be back with more videos very soon. Have a good one. Goodbye. <laughs>